Hi, this is Colin from Dexmat. Today I'd like to demonstrate the way that we measure the electrical resistance of our carbon nanotube materials, which allows us to calculate their conductivity. The measurement uses a digital multimeter, such as the one I'm using here, and what's known as a four-point probe. This probe has four electrical wires from the multimeter connected to four spring-loaded electrical contacts, known as pogo pins, that are fixed in this plexiglass frame so that the distance between the pins always stays fixed. In a four-point probe measurement, the outer two contacts deliver a fixed electrical current through the sample, and then the inner two probes measure the voltage drop between the portion of the sample that's between them. And this allows the multimeter to calculate and display the electrical resistance of the length of the sample between those two inner pins without having to worry about the unknown contact resistance between the metal pins and the sample. So I'll use this tool now to measure the resistance from some examples of our carbon nanotube materials. This first uh, material is an uh, example of our carbon nanotube yarn that is made up of many filaments of the carbon nanotube fiber. And that has oh, moment. Let me align the probes. Yeah, so that's got a resistance of around 0.2 ohms over this 10 centimeter length. This next um, uh, very thin line here on the paper is one single filament of our carbon nanotube fiber, so that'll have a significantly higher resistance. Okay, 14 ohms. And then finally, here's an example of our uh, narrow carbon nanotube tape. Now, we posted some videos recently showing off our wider carbon nanotube tape formats. It's important to note that once you go to a sufficiently wide tape, a probe like this that has these relatively closely spaced point contacts won't give accurate results anymore because the current won't be able to spread through the full width of the tape. So to measure the resistance of samples like that, we'll go to a, a different tool that instead of having a point contact, um, ha contacts the tape with a line of electrical contact across the width of the tape. Um, thanks very much for watching. To learn more about our materials and the way we, um, the way we test them, um, please check out our other videos and other content on our website, dexmat.com. Thanks very much.